what's up guys so this wasn't originally going to be a video but I've been hearing some stuff recently about the Xeno community and about um my name apparently again so this is gonna be like a double rant video today so the first thing we're going to talk about I guess is the Xenoverse 2 community because people were saying recently that the Xenoverse 2 community was going through some changes so the Xenoverse 2 community it has been going through some changes recently so as most people know or I think as some people are about to know a lot of the um the CAC players or whatever, the male Saiyan and male human guys, they recently uh, quit. I don't know if they quit quit, mind you, but they said they quit. And they basically were saying the game was dead, it was trash and all that other stuff. And people were like, oh, Zeno's just done now and all this extra stuff. And it was like, eh, but... Yeah, they were saying the game was dead now for real and that no one was playing and stuff, which there are a few people still playing, but it's going to be like really quiet now because they were really, the CAC players were the most competitive ones as far as the community goes. They took the game like super seriously. They played with rules. They try to get people to play with rules and CAC players in general are just very like rule based. That's why no one really likes the CAC players. It's because of their little mindset but yeah the CAC players are apparently starting to die out for real this time I don't think they're gonna be gone obviously for that long cuz they've left before multiple times and they're always gonna come back not that I really care about them there's probably maybe only like three CAC players I care about I really don't care too much about like CAC players to be honest they're just very egotistical and weird but um yeah, the community is just in a weird state right now. I don't know if it's going to get back to how it was before, because, like, last year, early 2022, the game was still, like, very active. It's not really too active right now. Comp isn't really active right now, but it might turn up soon. We'll see what happens in a few months, but it's probably not going to be, like, a big like worry as some people were trying to say because nine times out of ten those CAC players are gonna come back and they're gonna do what they always did they're just gonna take the game seriously try to get people to play with rules and brainwash people and you're just not gonna do oh I'm not gonna deal with it obviously because I do what I want they can't brainwash me but yeah people were just saying that recently and I kind of just laughed I did think um, the game did get like a little more or less active, but it's still active for some people. I'm still doing stuff on it, but um, that's what I think. That's my opinion now. That's for the Xenoverse 2 community part of this video. Now, this next part is really weird. I didn't want to have to do a rant video or a double rant video, but I'm apparently going to have to because I have some weirdos on me again, and I'm going to have to apparently deny some false out accusations or something because I had someone a homie hit me up yesterday and he said they were like people were like lying on my name and stuff so I found out recently I think like a month or two ago from one of my friends or quote-unquote former friends um, MHA that there was apparently another group of weirdos in the Xenoverse 2 community they're called I don't know who they are exactly but they hang out with like this weirdo called Rare Saiyan. He's some no life that streams Xeno every day for like six hours, I heard. But um, they're called XCL kids. They play with their own little rules. They have like CAC player logic, and they are apparently weirdos and no lives like Rampage and some other people that we ran into. Because he would um, this man in Mage when we were like. Um, when he would join my parties and stuff, he would tell me that, um, apparently that the, um, the XCL kids or whatever they're called, they apparently, like, talk about me a lot. He said they talk about me, like, what, every single day? Because they have this little Xenoverse Discord server where they, like, suck each other off and just play Xeno all day because they're no lives and they just sit on that game. But 
they were apparently spamming my face apparently he told me because he said they found like old pictures about me because rampage leaked some old pictures about me but he told me they were spamming pictures about me and like slandering me and they were calling me like a pedo i think or something which as far as that goes the pedophile allegations i'm not a pedophile i don't like even hang out with children like that i used to hang out with a friend group with like um that was mainly kids, but I don't hang out with them no more. I hang out with Ultima now. We're all grown men in Ultima's group. We don't hang out with children. No offense to my viewers. I know half my viewers are children, but... Yeah, we don't hang out with kids. I don't hang out with kids like that. I don't text them on Discord or other stuff like they were trying to say I did. And Somebody apparently faked a picture. One of the EUs did in his server because he was trying to say that... um. I'm not going to say exactly what was said, but he was basically trying to insinuate that I was a pedophile. And people in Rampage's server are weirdos. They spam my face just like these XEL kids, so... I'm going to assume that the XEL kids are either friends with Rampage or they just have weird like logic like he does. But anybody um, that spams my face like that is a straight up weirdo. I don't know who you are or half of you people are. I don't know any of you people. I don't know Rare Saiyan or none of y'all. And y'all are just randomly bringing my name up, just spamming old pictures about me. I'm pretty sure they're all kids, but I'm a grown man. I don't even do stuff like that. And they were trying to say, like, what, that I expose people a lot on Xenoverse and stuff, which, I mean, there has been a lot more exposed videos recently, but I only posted those exposed videos because you people just love spamming my face and y'all are just talking, like, trash for no reason. And y'all just slander me, apparently, for no reason, but... I don't really care if you slander me. I don't even care if you spam old pictures about me because at the end of the day, that just proves to me that one, you're weird. Two, you're probably a homosexual. And three, you just, you don't have a life. You're telling me you have nothing better to do with your time than just wake up every day and talk trash about Tasha Arkham and just spam old pictures about me as a kid. I'm telling you, man, this is another reason too why I didn't even want to be part of the Xenoverse 2 community because there's weirdos like this and they will spam people's faces and I had people like betray me over stuff like this I've had dudes like say stuff behind my back and I did let it slide at first but I'm not gonna let it slide anymore I'm really fed up with stuff like that but yeah um they were just being weirdos and they hang out with Johnny Angels I think which that explains perfectly when someone told me or when mh told me they hang out with johnny angels i was like it's no wonder they're weird because johnny angels he does that stuff too he spams pictures he's always talking about me like bro like get off my meat i know y'all guys love me but you really need to stop being weird you need to get out the house and go get a job or something because if you're just spamming pictures about me then i'm just gonna assume you're just weird and i'm not gonna really like I'm not going to interact with stuff like that too much. I didn't, like I said earlier, I didn't want to make this video, but I had to apparently silence some rumors and some false accusations being made about me. But yeah, as far as the XCL kids go, if you hang out with Rare Saiyan, Divine, or Johnny Angels, or whoever, I don't care. You're just going to get clipped and uploaded because y'all will talk all this trash, but y'all will duck. You will not fight me outside of rank. Some of them will. I know a lot of y'all are duckers, but I don't care. I'm not interested in fighting duckers, and I'm up on all of them. None of those XCL kids, whoever they are, none of them have me in debt. Johnny Angels is in debt in first of fives. He's not getting a run back ever. I'm never fighting him again. He's holding his debt, but I just, I don't know. Stuff like this is just weird, to be honest. I think um, what I'm going to do now I'm pretty much going to go back to how I was before, and for those of you that don't know what that means, I'm basically only going to be hanging out with friends now. I will still interact with some of you, because I know some of my fans want to reach out to me, and I'm still going to be there as far as like my responsibility goes for my subscribers. I'm not going to like punish you guys for stuff that weirdos like this do, but um, I will only be talking to like a few people now. I will still be running sets and stuff like always, but if you're not someone I know and I feel like I don't trust you, I'm just, I'm not going to associate with you, especially if you're friends with like Rare and these other weirdos. And that's basically my boundaries because 
I did, like I said, I let stuff like that slide and my, I'm just tired of it. I, I draw the line at people saying I'm a pedophile and just like making these false little accusations. I, I don't tolerate stuff like that. I don't care if you think it's funny. Stuff like that's not funny to me. But like I said, y'all guys can keep doing that. You're just gonna get blocked and I'm not really gonna give you like too much time out the day. But yeah, you just, I don't know what else to tell you guys. Y'all just, y'all play Xenoverse 2 tournaments. Y'all have a whole Discord for Xeno and y'all just talk about me all day and y'all call me a no life even though I work what every Monday through Friday none of y'all work all of y'all are children you need to act like children stop being weird and get off of Xeno cuz at the end of the day y'all are making no bread doing that I'm not even making bread uploading Xeno like that I'm only doing it as a hobby but yeah quick little public announcement though to the Xenoverse 2 community and to um, these weirdos if you if you fuck with this nigga Rare Saiyan and you hang out with Johnny Angels and Divine and these other people, just, just, I just want you to know right now, you will get clipped, you will get uploaded, and I, more than likely, I will not, like, be friends with you, and I don't care. I might, I'm, I might give you a shot if I feel like I can trust you, but I, I don't, I don't hang out with weirdos like this, because people like that just are very snakish. I ran into like, like I told you, I ran into like a few of them. They try to like lie and do some dumb stuff. They would go in my streams and stuff and try to be friendly, but I just, I don't fall for stuff like that. But that's how I feel about it. And for, yeah, anybody having doubts, um, no, I am not a pedophile. I don't talk to children. And as far as the slandering goes, if they want to keep doing that, I'm just going to let them keep doing that. I'm not going to give them too much attention. If I see you in ranked, you're gonna get clipped and uploaded, cause that's basically my way of saying haha -ha to you. Cause all that slander and all that little stuff you said about me, that's my way of getting back at you. But like I said, that's how I feel about the situations. But um, I'm gonna say um one more thing, and then I think I'm gonna cut it off here, cause I don't want to make this too long. But um, yeah, my final message um is gonna be to the weirdos mainly. So, as far as the weirdos go, you XCL kids or whatever you're called and rare, I just want you to know, one, half of y'all are in debt, I'm not in debt to any of you, and two, I want you to get a life, stop talking about me because I do not care in the slightest about any of you, and stay being trash, and just know at the end of the day, you can slander, you can do all this stuff, but you won't be able to stop me from doing what I have to do for my subscribers, because that's my job, is to, for my subscribers. But that's all from Tasa Arkham, I'll see you guys in the next video.